talking, man. Welcome back to the channel. Real quick, okay? I'm in a different uh, a different scenery right now. I'm in my studio, but I'm in my mechanic clothes, which means I'm in mechanic mode. Okay, what I want to talk about is uh, uh, I got a question from a young lady, uh, a soccer mom. She drives a minivan. Uh, for some reason... Now, that's not for some reason. D there is a reason. Uh, but for some reason, she felt she needed to add some transmission fluid. I guess somebody checked in and told her she was low. Okay, if you're low on transmission fluid, you likely have a leak. Okay, but that's not what I want to talk about. What I want to talk about is what you put in your transmission. Okay, now, I admit I've seen some, uh, there's some transmission fluid out there that supposedly will work in any transmission okay compatible with dextron compatible with chrysler compatible with uh uh ford compatible with mazda nissan compatible with any transmission i not i'm not a fluid analyst so and i i don't have much experience dealing with other type fluid other than what we use here at the shop which is a uh, atf plus four 7176 ATF plus four. That's all I'm accustomed to because that's mostly what I work on here uh, at the dealer. Okay, we've been hammered home uh, countless times as to that's what goes in. Uh, basically, transmissions like, uh, you know, the 62 TE. If she have a minivan, she likely have a 62 TE in it. Okay, but I don't know, man. I, I don't want to caution. I don't want to, uh, you know... If you don't have a choice, if you don't have anything in your car, sure, anything will work. Hell, power steering fluid will work, okay? Because it's basically just like transmission fluid, just a different color, okay? They had to separate the colors. But for the most part, if you are extremely low and you need some fluid to in an emergency situation, yes, use any kind of transmission fluid. But if you're just a little low and you're trying to top off, I highly suggest you use ATF plus four. If you're getting a transmission service or you're getting your transmission fluid changed, I highly suggest whoever doing it use the proper fluid, which is ATF plus four. For some reason, I don't know what reason, I, I've seen this uh, fluid in uh, Walmart now, so you have no excuse as to why you can't get none now. I mean, sure, you may have a hard time getting to the dealership to get some, but they now sell it in Walmart, people. So I don't understand. Uh, using the wrong fluid can cause you some problems. OK, I mean, I would not put Dextron in a Chrysler transmission or vice versa. And I'm not sure how one size fit all fluid will work in any transmission. Maybe I need to read more into that or grab some more knowledge on that topic, but I'm not sure that's possible. I'm not sure uh, you should do that. But like I said earlier, if you have nothing, go with anything. So that's what I want to talk about, man. The wrong fluid can harm your transmission. Basically, the wrong fluid can kill your transmission. So even if you're a quart low on transmission fluid and this is not an emergency state, uh, you mean you're not in an emergency situation, uh, don't just pour Dextron in it just because you're a quart low. <laughs> Go find you some ATF plus four because the wrong fluid can kill your transmission, could ruin your transmission. Do not use the wrong fluid. Use whatever your manufacturer suggests. In your case, lady, because you have a Chrysler uh, Grand Caravan, I think she said, your case is a uh, ATF plus four, okay? Now, if you have a leak on the flip side of that, if you have a leak or you having leaks, uh, you gotta get that fixed, okay? Because you're gonna ruin your transmission one way or the other, you're going to ruin it in the form of uh, you starved it to death, you overheated it, you know what I'm saying? So, or you can ruin it by simply using the wrong transmission fluid. So, either way, you got to get it repaired, get it fixed. Do not use the wrong transmission fluid in, a, in any car. I was going to say the Chrysler car. No, any car. Okay. And I just want to hammer that home to uh, this young lady. Uh, I don't want to call her name. I don't want to embarrass her. And I'm not. I'm not here for that. I just want to uh, hammer that home to whoever thinking about doing that. Whoever uh, 
I mean, you might find some cheaper fluid, but it is not compatible with Chrysler. You put it in there, you're going to kill your transmission, people. That's all I have to say, man. I'm going to leave that alone. Thanks for watching. Comment, subscribe, and I'll see y'all on the next video.